um it's my birthday i'm 26 i'm so freaking old and i just thought i would do a little vlog today because i got some little free library footage yesterday and then i also have a, like a lot of book things to show you guys so we'll start with the little free library stuff and then after that um i'll just show you my day it's gonna be a pretty pretty chill 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 day i got <laughs> I forgot I ordered this shirt when I was sad because um, I had just finished The Last of Us and I love a good retail therapy. It says Pedro Pascal, am I saying that right? Pedro Pascal fan club. And I love it. It's oversized. It's so comfy. It's like comfort colors. I'm probably going to be way too embarrassed to ever wear this in public, but I love it. So yeah, and I just realized the lighting was probably horrible on that. There she is. No, they upgraded it. I wonder if my book's still here. It's not. I put in some pink book. That's good at time. Yeah. Oh, it's in good shape. I don't know what that is. Hmm. Fat Tuesday. Relatable. Every Tuesday for me is fat. <laughs> it's just a relatable. Oh. Veggie tails. God is with me. Huh. Nothing really. Can you this? Woohoo! Wow, they got some good ones in here, it looks like. Sink together. Microcrimes. Camina Hendrix. Jazz in the bittersweet. Blue is cool. The glass. Okay. Hmm. okay. There's always gonna be another mountain. Always gonna wanna make. I think it's all the same ones from last time. Friday Night Lights again. Love that dog. Wow, literally all of these are the same. Never have I ever. Relatable. My whole life without a date, that's what it was called, the first wave. Hmm. Let me live. Maybe I should put some in. Oh, that, oh, that looks steamy. So I was gonna do a voiceover of those clips for the little free libraries, but then I was listening to my commentary and I thought it was funny or really just dumb. But, and then it didn't even really matter because I didn't find anything amazing in there. I did see that a book I put there one time was gone. So that's good to know. And then I actually did go to a really good one. It had like the Kite Runner, Little Women, and a few others that I recognized, but I could see the couple in their house with the windows. Um, the blinds are open and stuff like that and they could see us and I just hate when people can see us and like especially when I'm videoing so I didn't video there but I'll definitely include it in the next one because that one's always super cute and it's the closest to my house but let's get back into the video okay let's start with this book I have not actually read this book but I started this show on Hulu tiny beautiful things and as soon as I started it, I was like, wait, this is based on the book I have that I never read that I found on TikTok probably two years ago and then haven't read because I'm awful at buying books and then reading them when I want to. So that show on Hulu is so good and it's so sad. I've seriously cried in every episode. So get the book, read the book first and then watch the show. And it has Sarah Pigeon in it, who was my favorite character in the wilds on Amazon. And she is just amazing. So. You should go watch that. I'm gonna go get my freebie birthday treat from Starbucks and typically I would do a coffee but I totally forgot and I was so excited to have 
a latte for my Nespresso this morning. I already had coffee. So I'm gonna get a bagel. And I also wanna show you guys my little coffee setup. I'm so proud of it. Um, let's see. So my mom got me the Nespresso for my birthday. I finally just asked for one because I've been wanting one forever and I love it. Um, you definitely have to be a latte or espresso girly to get one because I've made the normal coffee on there, the Ice Virtue, the Ice Virtue, Virtue. I don't know why I can't say that now. And it's just not as good. I love the Ice Legero pods. I love the Starbucks Blonde Roast. I love the decaf is so good. Sam got this orange one, which I don't know what it is. And then the Virtue is in the back. Oh, and I also have, Sam got me the Bianca Dope, Dopeo for my birthday. And these are double espresso and they're so good with a nice latte, if I can show you. So those are in there. And then Sam's parents got me this storage um, pod container for it for my birthday. And it holds so many, so it's perfect. And then yesterday I went to TJ Maxx and I got this cute little holder. I got the vanilla syrup off of Amazon. I found this for $5 at Marshall's, the salted caramel. I found this little sauce at Marshall's as well. I wanted to find the caramel one, but this one's good. I had it this morning. I don't really like caramel or like a chocolate sauce in it, but just for guests or when I'm feeling bougie, I'll use it. And then I have these espresso cups as well. And then I ordered like a glass crystal espresso cup and then a cute straw holder. And I'm gonna put my straws in there as well. So that's that. And I'll go get my bagel from Starbucks. I'm obsessed. Go on Nespresso TikTok if you're trying to convince yourself if you want one. But honestly, I definitely recommend it. Okay, I came home and devoured that bagel and then I watched two hours of The Jamelia Show. I have to show you guys some bookish things now. My, all of my books this year from Sam were related to like book talk or book, the book community. And the last thing he got me was this stamp that says from the Library of Maddie. And this is the ink pad. And I actually never told him I wanted this and I definitely wanted it for myself, but um, I don't know how he came up with it. So I'm so excited because I do have a lot of books and I can all stamp them. And then this stack right here are all of my books that are listed on Pango Books. And so this morning when I woke up, somebody had bought a bundle of Seven Days in June and The Kiss Quotient. I literally took this with me yesterday when I went little free library hunting and I'm glad I didn't find anything I wanted and left that there because it's crazy that someone bought it the next day. But I'm so excited. So these are two pretty popular books um, and I hope the buyer likes them. And then, oh gosh, where is my, then somebody bought these two books together, The Cheat Sheet and Beautiful Disaster. And I feel like I have some pretty good books listed on Pango Books. I don't have, I only have these two left since I've sold my other ones. Um, but they're like two or three dollars on there if you guys want them. I'm going to ship them out tomorrow and leave a cute little note in the box. So I can't wait. My other birthday gift from Sam was this reading chair that I love. It's from Wayfair. I think if you just type beanbag chair this will pop up and then he got me a kindle paperwhite it's the green one you can kind of see it um coming through right there but it's green on the back and it matches this green little case he also got me and right now i'm currently reading magnolia parks the long way home which is the third one in the magnolia parks universe and i am just eating this kindle up i am reading every day i'm finishing books like it's nothing and there are so many good Kindle Unlimited books on here too. I just, I really don't think I'll ever go back to favoring paperback books. Um, it's just so easy to travel with and I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Definitely recommend. And this one, I was, I talked a little bit more about it in my previous video, but the touch screen is instant. Um, whereas in the older Kindles, they're not very fast. Sam came home for lunch and brought me flowers. So cute and sweet. Love that boy. 
also so funny um we just got these yesterday from tj maxx they're fake and i just thought the vase was cute and everything and now i have two beautiful flowers right here on this table my little container for the straws came in i'm obsessed with this area love it love it love it and this is all for this vlog. It was honestly kind of random, but it did have a lot of bookish content. So if you liked it, definitely subscribe because my next few videos will be reading vlogs or maybe my wrap up for April, May TBR. And I would love for you guys to stick around. So thanks for watching and subscribe down below. Bye.